So you may have heard that dogs' mouths are cleaner than humans. So we thought, just for fun, that we would test that theory. Uh, first, we're going to swab Brian here. So, Brian, ah, now it's Loki's turn. Come here, baby. And now, just for fun, we're going to do a kitty. This is Rasmus. He's a younger boy. Come here. Come here, honey. He's all right. Open. Open. Oh, I know. Oh. Okay, so now we're off to the lab. We'll see who has the dirtiest mouth. The human? The puppy or the kitty? Okay, the results are in, and basically not such a big deal. Everybody has similar types of bacteria in their mouth. So the myth that dogs have cleaner mouths really truly is still a myth. Basically it stems from way back when in the old days, a study was done on bite wounds. When people bit people, the wounds got more infected. When dogs bit people, the wounds didn't get as infected, so it was assumed dogs' mouths were cleaner. Now there are different factors that cause that, and it's not really the bacteria per se, it's a bunch of other things all rolled into one. But one thing that we do know that is key to keeping everybody's bacteria down is good dental hygiene. You brush your teeth, so should your dog or cat. You go to see the dentist once a year to have that smile cleaned, so should your dog or cat. If you have any questions, give us a call. We can work you through that process. 396-3333, thanks. When you're feeling down and out, we have a remedy that you don't need a prescription for. At the Pet Hui, we believe the bond between you and your pet is the strongest remedy for you and your heart. Adopt one of these dogs and begin your journey to lifelong friendship and happiness. This is Sydney, a beautiful seven-year-old mix who was abandoned. She's sweet, but scared and a little shy. With the right home, she will do very well and take to her new family very quickly. This is Piper, a Hawaiian Humane Society rescue. Her family abandoned her. She's a very high energy dog with a sweet personality. She would do best in an active family or one that has a yard. This is Jesse. Jesse was found in Waianae after he had either been hit by a car or had been severely abused in some way and he was left by the side of the road. He needs a loving home to heal his heart. This is Loke and he was abandoned. He likes to hang out with people all day and is an older boy looking for his forever home. He is the Animal Care Foundation mascot and a true love who deserves to live out his golden years with a loving family. For more information about how to adopt any of these pets, call the Animal Care Foundation at 396-3333.